This is what I would make Taylor Swift if given the chance. Well, that's not entirely true, but this whole look is so speak now Taylor's version coded that it truly felt like it could belong in her show. Or maybe I'm just batting way out of my league. It's likely that. Anyway, I've been sitting on this lavender haze fabric forever, trying to come up with something super elegant, super couture, but within my skill set. And I actually haven't done a style like this in ages. It's probably because I got tired of being asked. Sarah, what do you wear that? So maybe the answer is pretty obvious, nude undergarments. But if you never knew you could get skin tone matching underwear, then I understand the question. This whole dress is hand sewn. The only thing sewn by the machine is the lining and the rest is sewn together with tears and hurting fingers and a ton of patience and a few cordy breaks of course i once again used real silk chiffon though the quality of this one is insane so light so delicate i was afraid to tear it definitely afraid to cut it and it has the most beautiful drape and of course you guessed it it's all hand sewn the trickiest part about this is around the skirt especially on the wide hip pieces i didn't want them to shift too much because that's a disaster waiting to happen you know it took me like six tries to get the drape in the front right and at the last second i decided to add the sleeve it was a great choice. And for more texture, you guessed it, more hand sewing. You guys are so smart. Yes, I cut out the lace pieces like an applique and put them over it. Anyway, this is the final look. I love it. I think it came out a great. I listened to the entire Speak Now Taylor's version while making this at least three times. And to me, this just screams Taylor Swift. And yes, I will do this again.